This poem is called Dark Matter. Don't let anything or anyone snatch you out of happiness, which in all honesty, as opposed to selling something, is gratitude. How many times a day do you say thank you instead of assault at a head? How ready the heart for values that cannot be measured by the dollar or advertisement which is my master and yours too? In all honesty, had that been something of value, there are no gods in America unless, of course, your god is green and greedy, complicit and complacent, compliant and easily compromised. It would ease so many in their conscience if I say money is not the enemy. Yet who are we kidding? Don't we already know enemies aren't real except perceived threats? So you mean to tell me you worship your heart or your Jesus or your Allah or your Jehovah? Are you sure there isn't something else guiding you each day out the door toward a perceived purpose? And what would you be doing had money no business? New York City tells me one hour of the average human being's life is worth $7.25. And what is $7.25 to a dollar if a dollar is only a piece of paper, which is only a representation of value? We don't actually have anything to show for except what we purchase, which is only the value we give it, except what we give is measured by what we take and call valuable. And where is all the gold these banks claim to represent? I wish, I wish I could tell you about some kind of inner gold you possess, but I'm still digging for mine as if I could own what's inside me, as if it's not part of something greater than matter or sight or this English, which limits the agreements we can make together about our existence here together. In 2012, 12, scientists claim they found the God particle, this question, this troubling missing factor of our weight, our hold, our value they claim. And yet, yet we have no evidence except the collision of values. Most of what we know and how we see ourselves is determined by five Western countries, five of which determine value by how well they kill others. And we out here screaming, black lives matter, as in exists or takes up space, as in atoms, molecules, as in mass. Ain't there some funny irony there? I'm starting to believe that this is all we value is each other's death more than life. And if life's so valuable, how come? How so? It's not lost on me that death is part of life. Some die so others live. But who, who is doing all the dying exactly at the expense of all this living? And are you really being?